Hello guys, I'm Yash and I will be showing you how to install drivers for USB ASP program. So before installing the drivers, we need to download a certain program and that's Zadig. Let's go to Zad, Let's download Zadig. Zadig is the, you will get the very first link for the program. Zadig USB driver installation made easy. Just click on it and you will go to the website. Then make sure you download the latest version that's Zadig 2.3 and save file. I've already downloaded, so download is complete. Before installing the driver, make sure you plug in your USB SP. So uh, first I will be plugging in my USB ASP and it's plugged in. I'll just double click and then the application. So we are here you go. Click on the option and check on list all the devices. Once you check that option, you will see all the USB devices that are connected to your computer. So we are looking for the USB ASP and my device, my USB ASP is the fourth device. Yes, I will click on it. Uh, now on my computer, the USB drivers have been already installed. So it's showing the cur driver, current driver version in the driver section. And whereas if I want to and on the other right hand box, it's showing if I want to replace the driver with some other driver so no I don't want to replace the driver just make sure that you click the click the down arrow and check lib and make select lib usb win32 version 1.2.6 and just install the driver now I'm getting this of the installed driver because I've already installed so just for installing the driver in in by any case if you don't have if you haven't already installed the driver so you will be seeing install or the option install driver instead of reinstall the driver so the driver was installed successfully it's close now let's go to device manager all right so here's the atmel usb devices under which i can see my usb sp this means my usb sp has been successfully installed and it is ready to use so once but let's just check with the avr duties in avr duties select the programmer and my programmer is usb asp so it's fourth from the bottom and click detect so i haven't connected on the microcontroller so it's saying that unable to detect and see you so when you click the detect button you will see a flashing red light on your usb asp that means the communication between your computer and the usb asp has been successful and that's for this video in another video i'll be showing how to set fuse bytes for the fuse bits for the atmel 80 mega 328 microcontroller as well as also how to upload a program to the microcontroller thank you if you like the video do share it subscribe the channel and hit the like button